everyone. I'm on my way down from a hike up Mount Adams, which is in the Adirondack Park <clears throat> in upstate New York. And on my way up, I noticed while climbing up this uh, trail that there was a flat area that looks very similar to an overgrown uh, road. So knowing that the area used to be used for mining purposes uh, to extract iron from the rocks, um, I was looking around and I noticed that there are some rocks here that look very different from the granites that we're used to seeing. So here's an example of that granite right here actually. Um, so it looks very different. Um, and knowing that there was iron that was mined from this area, I figured let's see if these rocks are magnetic. So I have this example here um, and using the magnetic part of my water bladder um, I was able to investigate and see whether or not they're magnetic and it looks like this rock certainly is magnetic. So not all the rocks here are. Um, this rock is equally dark in color but does not seem to be magnetic. This is a great example here which I can show you in the class that uh, has a wonderful band of magnetic uh, material here. But some parts of the rock do not. So it looks like this is a wonderful example of a vein of magnetite here surrounded by some rock that isn't too uh, magnetic. So remember when you're out in the field, look around, see when things change. This rock looks very different from this rock, right? If you have questions, see if you can answer them. Sometimes the answer is really exciting.